this is the uh, next gen display the smaller one uh, which is uh, resolution 320 b 240 um, they, they do a whole range right up to a, a large seven inch display um, let me show you what we've been doing with this first of all so I'm going to show you the display there it is um, has some nice pretty buttons on it um, if you um, press the buttons they change on and off uh, I've got a button down here that glows green when it's on I've got a LED indicator flashing on and off I've got some random information going on I've got buttons that change just while you hold them um, and uh, in the final thing of course this is obviously going to be a thermostat uh, right so what we've got here you look on the back we have uh, a little ESP12 control board, which we designed. Now, what we're looking at here is a four-way cable, but actually only two wires are being used, plus and minus. So it's run off five volts, and it's talking wirelessly uh, over the Wi-Fi using MQTT protocol, so that um, the protocol is sending this changing information, and when I press a button, it sends information out uh, back to a Raspberry Pi, as it happens. Uh, to control stuff so as you can see pretty nice display um, utterly reliable buttons and uh, there there it is um, quite thin could quite easily mount that on a um, on a bezel if you can get a bezel the right size and I've just ordered one of those little vibrators from phones to stick on there they're just a few pence each so that actually when you press the buttons you get haptic feedback as well so let's see uh, how i achieve this obviously buttons like this don't exist within the next gen environment uh, how did i uh, get them you'll be surprised how easy it is to do let's head over to the blog